The thrash and mill of the past is now reinvented as a tourist attraction at vintage rallies. The steam engine in R has found a new role in today's collector society and rally visitors. Even the bath that I used to hae my weekly bath in as a bairn is used as a drinking trough for nout. That style of baths originated in the 1950s and now are back in fashion in modern bathrooms. Aye, it's a funny old world. The stooks in the parks roon about the steden are now replaced by roon bales. The dry steen dykes that my ancestors chaffed to big have been teen awa with these great muckle machines. The smart parks are awa and ah. They have lost their names and now are combined to mark big parere style parks suitable for the day's big machinery. The labour, the sickle and the horse are replaced by the one pass drilling machine and the muckle tractors with their lonely operators. Even the craz a day no reest an echt on the pylons. I mind fine fin the used to reest in the craw a over here an echt. We see arable parks being allowed to return to their uncultivated state through the policy of set aside. I dinna ken fit my ancestors would think of allowing the thistles, dokens, tansies, weeds, brambles, and the bream that they chaffed to pull out with the bream dog to return. I'm sure they would be dumb foonert with this agricultural policy. Aye, changes fit I has happened in rural Aberdeenshire a run about Benahi, and change might be for the better, and every cloud has a silver lining. Here is a wildlife belt run about the edges of a park. Fine to see some farmers thinking about the wild animals just the way our ancestors did. Here is a traditional Aberdeenshire park of ripening corn and a black face yow. And just aside them, a wind turbine, where an awa generating electricity in an environmentally friendly way. In 2005, the first wind fern would bigot in the shadow of Benahi at the glens of Foundland. There are 20 wind turbines there, costing £31 million.